Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. Uh, today we're gonna start a little bit early for Friday when we were on the other channel the market was not moving at all the first couple hours the market was just flat in a way and then uh, what what we have said uh, on the on the other channel usually Friday in the afternoon the market start trending and that's exactly what what we said and this is exactly what happened so uh, sometimes it happened that uh, the market goes sideways uh, in the morning on a Friday, but then in the afternoon uh, the market starts start trending. Uh, so we're going to start um, uh, early today to see uh, the market in action. And uh, we're going to start with the uh, YM9 range uh, on the last trade is 1425 uh, on the YM three minutes, the last trade is 3,480. Uh, on the YM uh, 10 range, 3,220 on the last trade. Uh, on the YM one minute, 1,500 on the last trade. Uh, on the ES, uh, we have 4,700 on the last trade. And uh, this is a really amazing seven range. Uh, on the DAX, uh, 8,000 on the last trade, uh, 10 range. On the YM, four minutes, we have 3,975 on the last trade. On the ES6 range, we got 4,650 on the last trade. On the NASDAQ, we got 4,100 on the last trade. On the DAX7 range, we got 9,668. On the gold, we got 2,500. On the NASDAQ 5 minutes, we got 7,820. On the DAX 150 takes, we got 7,817. On the gold 10 range, we got 1,960. On the YM 200 takes, 380. Welcome to trading. You have to see the good and the bad. Uh, on the DAX 9 range, we got 7,700 on the last trade. On the uh, DAX, this is a one minute, it's only 1,500. On the gold 8 range, 3,200 based on 8 range. ES 5 minutes is about to close that trade is 5,300. On the DAX, uh, 100 take is 8,640. On the Russell, four minutes is 2,040. On the Russell, three minutes is 4,600. On the DAX, we still have one open position. It is 7,225 base on 200 ticks. On the gold, four minutes, we got 2,400. On the Russell, 200 ticks, we got 1,500. On the last trade, the four minutes, 5,170 on the NASDAQ. The four minutes is very important chart. On the DAX four minutes, 9,566. On the YM, 3,660 on the last trade, five minutes chart. On the gold three minutes chart, 2,520. 
took the trade from here. On the DAX, 8 range, 9,386. On the DAX, 5 minutes, 5,900, and they still kicking. On the ES, 6,700 on the 8 range. 8 range is a very important chart. On the Russell, 5 minutes, 2,120. On the YM, there is nothing. On the DAX, 4,800. On the morning session, the NASDAQ, 100 take, 1,900. And this one was in the on the other channel early this morning. Uh, the YM6 range, 1,495. The 10 range, 1,000 even. The NASDAQ 200, 1,000. Those are the morning session. The Russell 150 takes, 1,800. And the NASDAQ 2 minutes, 2,955. And the NASDAQ 150 takes. You can see what time it closed. Those are morning session at 9.45. And the market was not moving. The market absolutely was a chop market. And uh, 1,790. The NASDAQ 1 minute, 1,185. The Russell uh, 8 range, 2,000. And the Russell 7 range, 1,400. And the Russell 8 range, 1,295. And the Russell 5 range, 1,375. And, and the Russell 2 minutes, 1,300. On the ES 5 range is 1,000 even. And you can see it was done even before 10 o'clock. On the CL7 range, 1,490. And uh, I want to cover a little bit about the market analyzer. The market analyzer, uh, there is a five auto trade. This is a base on the last entry signal, not the whole day. The last entry signal we have 1,112 ticks into the profit based on the last entry signal and based on one contract only. If you don't have the money, you don't need to trade all of it. You can trade ES, 111 ticks based on the last entry signal. The NASDAQ, 540 ticks based on one contract, one lot, 2,700. The YM, based on one contract, 186, the CL, 27 takes. So if you don't have money, also you can use a micro account and you can use a micro account on the ES, NASDAQ, Dow Jones and CL. Those are the numbers uh, we showed you on the charts. They still open position from the DAX. The DAX was number one and then you can see the NASDAQ is head to head with the, with the DAX, it's amazing. And then the ES, and uh, then uh, the YM all the way at the bottom, and the gold is all the way at the bottom. So the performance this afternoon on Friday was the DAX uh, went way up, and then the NASDAQ is between the DAX and, and the ES as well. So this is a very, a very impressive uh, performance on the NASDAQ and, and uh, the ES uh, to be competing uh, with the DAX because the DAX is very expensive. And if we notice the first four ones, I mean, there are 8,300 and then uh, the, uh, the, the NASDAQ is uh, number one, two, three, four. The NASDAQ is number five and uh, the ES is number six. This is very impressive. And then you can see the ES got in mixed with the with the with the DAX, and then uh, the Nasdaq at the bottom, and the YM and the gold, and then the Russell all the way down. So the best performance today was the Nasdaq ES and the DAX. Folks, we wish you a really pleasant weekend, safe weekend, 
and uh, to our members we will see you on monday webinars members only thank you very much and god bless you all bye for now